All right, what's up, guys? It's Mr. Rasmussen here, the woodbender. I'm the master of all shop elements, and today I'm the master of everything coating. So we're going to be talking about weighted choice and how to make uh, weighted choice inside of Python. So a weighted choice means we're deciding between options that have different chances of happening. When something's purely random, every option has the same chance of being picked. Weighted choice comes into effect when we want one or more options to have a larger or smaller probability of being chosen. So instead, of, if I had a random choice between 1 and 10, each of those numbers has a 10% chance of being chosen. But I can change it so that between the numbers 1 and 3, those say have a 70% chance of being chosen. Um, another example would be, say, the probability of you bringing an umbrella with you to school. The probability of that happening should be proportionate to the chance of it actually raining that day. See, it doesn't rain every single day. And it doesn't even rain proportionate to the days that it doesn't rain. It's more rare when it rains for us here in Utah. So, here's what it kind of looked like. If var, var just stands for variable, is less than or equal to 30 on a, if we do a 1 to 100 random choice. So we're just saying if it's less than or equal to 30, we're going to do something. Else, everything between 31 and 70, or 100, is going to be our else option. So here's what the code would look like. We have a random number from 1 to 100 being selected and being stored in a variable called var. So if var is less than or equal to 30, we're going to do the first thing, whatever we want it to do. Else, we're going to do the second thing, which is 31 to 100. And this ends up giving us a different weight of choice. The thing that's 70% chance of happening is more likely to happen in this case. And here's another situation we could do. Here's three choices, three options of things happening. If the random number falls between 0 and 30, we ha we're going to do option 1. If it falls between 31 and 50, we're going to do option 2. Else, everything between 51 and, 51 and 100 will end up happening. So else has the largest chance of happening. Var, second most, and this one has the third with 20, only 20% chance of happening right here. Here's what that code would look like. Random number being selected between 1 and 100 being stored in the variable var. If var is less than or equal to 30, do the first thing. Else if, remember using the else if makes it so that it only triggers between 31 and 50. Uh, do the second thing and then we're, we would also have an else statement that would do 51 through 100. So that's how we make a weighted choice. Use this information to complete the assignments today. Thanks for watching and have a great day.